Welcome to this week in gaming. Unless you've just been playing Roblox, you know the biggest story is Epic suing Apple. In short, Epic offered a direct payment option offering V-Bucks at a 20% discount. Since Apple could not collect their 30% cut, they removed Fortnite from the App Store. Ubisoft's Hyperscape debuted this week. And even though the beta testing went well, the game was a massive flop. Don't give up on them yet. Ubisoft took many years to make a franchise out of Rainbow Six. Also this week, Fall Guys was released and it was so popular that the servers crashed. I like playing Fall Guys. Game controls are simple and anyone can play. Just don't get eliminated. Local news. Patricia Jones was sent to the principal's office for skipping school. She was watching Little Pack on stream. That's me. Uh, I do not see the problem in that. There's no problem. <laughs> Congratulations to Probably for setting the world record for swimming across the ocean. Wait, Wait guys, I'm getting an input. I'm getting an input from a reliable source. Probably has been disqualified from that world record. I am sorry. You were riding shark, apparently. There are photos and videos of you riding shark. Tragic. We have not heard from him in a while, and he is probably in a witness protection program. Bob Jeff finally found out his real name is not Jeff but it is actually Sal. You're watching Point Recap. Early on, Probably and Cyrus were fighting for the lead. While the rest had a slow start as the week went on, the Dark Phantom rose up the ranks while Cyrus went on a trip and dropped a third. Niels, Bob Jeff, and Little Skeletor staying in the hunt. Keon, Sir Millie, and No Limit Tay rounded out the top ten. And that's it for Points Recap. But I wanted to welcome one of our most recent subscribers in the weekly welcome. Welcome to our channel, FNA9 Dark Bomber. He is a legend just like all of you are. 